Welcome back, you guys. This is the Syndra. Continuing my Hoi 4 Kaiserai campaign as the Kingdom of Italy. So, I did try a console command to annex... Uh, what is it? Aquitaine? Whatever this was. The Grand Duchy of Occitania. So, I don't know if this is going to work. Or if I'm going to get the factories. Yes, I am. Okay. So, that worked. Which is good, because I fucked up. I'm glad that was rectifiable. I'm gonna put two more of these to use up the rubber. And I think... I'm gonna put more into you. And then just, I don't know, support equipment? Yeah, we're done. And then we just import some more oil. Okay, let's continue this war against Switzerland. Hopefully... Nothing crashes. Oh, there we go. We get that again. So. We're gonna occupy it. So we do pay the cost. We don't get away with that. As our troops have landed in Britain. Independence for England and Scotland. I'm thinking of making England uh, a vassal. Yeah. That should be fine. The new leader of Britain. As we organize a new government of Britain, the establishment of a cabinet of collaborationist generals seemed as the most advised solution. However, Don Jacob Fitz Stewart, a Spanish duke and descendant of the old Catholic House of Stewart, has, for the first time, presented his claim to the British throne. Despite papal pressure, we should keep in mind that even the slight idea of a Catholic king is likely to set the British people into a heavy riot. Restore the House of Stuart. Whoa, we get minus 400 political power? Fuck it. We are the Catholics. It's about time you learn. Oh, they lose 400 political power. <laughs> Oops. So I'm going to take a look at my uh, factories here. Yeah, we don't have as many factories as we did. So. I'm going to... I'm going to... I'm going to... Hmm. Let's uh, rectify this a bit. So. I want to keep this maxed. I want to upgrade this. I want to use up the tungsten we have. We have some extra rubber. And yeah. Okay. That's good. So this is done. It's 1942. We still haven't finished this. There's 29 days left. Fuck. Okay. Uh, we might as well use this since we have a discount. And we have engineer company. Done. Thank you. Recon. It seems that we cannot push into their capital. I'm going to let them move into our here. So they're going to spread pretty thin. What is this? Oh, these are my tanks. They're ready. My tanks are ready. Giovanni Messi. Okay. I need you to get your organization. I'm going to put you guys onto normal and like this. Okay. I think we can delete these. Fallback lines. And I'm going to change your color because you match the other ones. Sure. Get in there. Um, almost there. Okay, I'm going to tell all of you guys to move into this province. All of you are going to wipe them out. They can pierce my divisions, and we are low on supply. Oops. Oh no. One of our dudes died. Uh, 
Okay, we were able to take the airport. Oh, come on, take the airport. Ah, uh, there we go. Okay. You guys cannot go here. There we go. Can we not cross there? See, they're spreading out very thin over here, which is kind of stupid, because they're not going to get anything out of it. Wait, can I take his capital? Is that actually what's going to happen? I took his capital. Ha! Ha! Ah! And they are willing to surrender? Yes! So I'm going to pass once. And I'm going to take all states. And turn. Done. The Swiss are ours. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. So. These are our allies. These two are puppets. This is my puppet. There are many like it, but this one is my own. I'm going to put you guys... I don't really know what to do right now. I want to train another 12 of these dudes. What are we lacking? Motorized and light tanks. Okay. The annexation of Switzerland. Occupy them. I want that. I want it. I'm sorry. Like, England is too far away to be useful. And they should get their own unique tree. They did not get their own tree. Fuck. And they have fuck all for manpower. Why do you have puppets in this game? They don't do anything. Fuck. I might have to annex them again, probably. That's probably what's going to have to happen. Uh huh. So where do we go next? Middle Europa is way, way too strong. Kingdom of France is a part of the Entente. Portugal is a part of the Entente. Did not know that. Uh, it's 1942. Let's get the rest of these. We have three military factories that we stole from the Swiss. Give me this. Uh huh. This is too much. Mm -hmm. There we go. Uh, we have 15 military factories. Really? Well, let's just import some more tungsten then. And... Yeah. More tungsten. Beautiful. Uh, what can we do with this army experience? Are we? Do we have the highest tank? No, we don't. 1942. We can get this tank and then pimp it out. Once we have that unlocked. So, going after Austria, I don't really th think so. Like, I'm not sure we can take them on. Let's see. They have extensive conscription and, yeah, no. They have a lot of manpower. But then again, we are right next to their capital. No. Or not? Did they move it? Or do they start in Vienna? I'm confused. But all of this belongs to Austria. All of this. Okay. Turkey. We can go after Turkey, I suppose. Spain is our allies. States three. The third part of the National Development Program has techni technically been going on since the program initiation, but since the program's initiation. But now that the rest of the work is done, the 
progress can accelerate. This part consists of various efforts of land clearance, such as the clearance of the Pontine Marshes. This will enable us to improve our long-term industrial potential. We get research bonus for construction, and we get building slots. Okay, so this, that was not worth it. Not This was not worth 210 days. No. If I do this again, I'm never taking that. Because the one before it was awesome. It removed the bad uh, national uh, idea. And national spirit, I mean. And it gave us political power. And you could have, I could have stopped there. Had I known that it was that bad. But I think there's one event left. So we'll see. I don't know where to advance to. Do we just go after the Germans? I don't think so. I mean, they have service by requirement, which is pretty high. But they have a lot of people. National focus complete. Uh, the program has been a great success. Not only the population likes the results, but perhaps even more importantly, the government does. Now it is time to put our effort elsewhere. Oh, that we get 100 political power to finish it off. Okay. Uh, I'm so tempted to cheat and just annex in the Italian Republic. Mm. Uh, See, I'm debating actually cheating right now. I'm sorry, guys. I am I am debating it. I don't really call it cheating. I got fucked by the peace treaty. Mm, you know what? I'm going to do it. So let's see here. We got... Uh, what's it called? A tea debug? So you guys are called SRI. SRI. Annex SRI. See, now I own them. I cheated, guys. I annexed them. So I could do my... There we go. Incorporate the self. I am sorry, guys, but I was so frustrated that I was tempted with to scrapping this campaign. But now I'm going to stop cheating. I promise. So I can finally do this national focus. National, yeah. Incorporate the South. You get 150 political power. Remove national spirit divided nation. And we gain cores. Ah, I'm sorry, guys, but it was I was so demoralized after that. I wanted to quit. So please give me this. Please let me do this without it being too much of a fuss. But then again, it's up to you. If you think I should undo this, let me know. But please don't. I'm begging you. Wait, this is the wrong one. This one. There we go. Ah, okay, the annexation of southern Italy and the reunification of Italy. Italy is now, once again, more than just a geographical term. The army of southern Italy has surrendered and the Socialist Republic has been annexed. Some people celebrated in the streets, but not everyone was ha as happy to see us. This will change with time. Oh, okay. Uh, okay, we're done. No more cheating. But it does seem that sometimes when this... Especially with uh, an alpha mod, you want to cheat to undo some unnecessary shit. I don't think that was... It was not the mod's fault that that happened. It was just... Germany declared war on France, so I jumped in and decided to... Yeah, I want to declare on them. But then, instead of... Like, there was a peace deal with the Commune of France. They, the Commune of France just died. And instantly became a puppet of the Germans. Whatever they had became a puppet of the Germans. And I kept what I had. Which is kind of stupid. Why does Germany get priority over what happens to the Commune of France when we're still at war with the uh, Union of Britain. I don't understand that. That seems inaccurate. Campania under our control. 
I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. Should I disallow this or was this justified? It was two provinces. It was two provinces. It was Sicily and uh, Campania. Uh, yeah, whatever. I don't know what that is. So now that this is done, we can go here. Claim the northeast. That would piss off Austria. I think this would get uh, bypassed. Claim Malta, Tunisia. Yeah, we can now finally get some more CBs on people. And I'm getting even more factories here. Are we building them right now? Oh, yes, we are. And we are apparently repairing everything in Switzerland. We basically bombed the fuck out of their roads. Okay. So I'm thinking the chances are better against Austria than against Germany. Because basically, if I can hold this corridor... Thank you. We can uh, cause a lot of casualties. It's in the mountains. We have our mountain troops, which are godly. So yeah, let's... Um, I'm going to put you guys here and here. And I'm going to take three of you and put you here. Okay. So you guys, the tanks... Let's get... The best tanks and update this. Um, I'm gonna have you guys down here. Actually, yeah. I want you guys here. And let's split you off 10. Yeah. So there are 13 dudes here that will just march across. And then you guys do the same. And we can have the tanks over here. Because this is more flatland than uh, this. And we do have some more tanks incoming. Sicily under our control. Okay. And who the fuck are you? Carlos Spain. Why are you in my land? See, this is a proper ally. They still have some troops. Mm, wait, we can... Oh, we're using all the tungsten that we can. Mm -hmm. How many more factories are we building here? We're building nine more. Okay, so we got four here. So we got five more. Three. Oh, okay. We'll worry about it later. Fuck, I'm still thinking about that. Did I do the right thing? <laughs> I have guilt. I have so much guilt. Um, I'm going to put you guys here. I'm going to take off this. I'm going to put you guys here as well. Mm, yeah. So I'm thinking we go after Austria. I think we can handle them. And we got all our cores back, so our manpower is just awesome right now. And we did Patria Nostra as well. Yeah, White Guard is 2%. Patria Nostra is 5 and Extensive Constriction is 5 as well. Um... Chief of Navy. We want... No. Yeah, capital ships. How is our navy doing, by the way? Oh, we got our first ship. Booyah! What is it called? Conti di Cavour. Okay. Interesting. Going to war with these guys is going to be interesting. I'm going to have... I'm going to make some f fighter planes here on interception. And some more here. 
on interception. Yeah. Having unique planes on interception. I could build some radar. Oh, wait, have I unlocked radar? I didn't, don't know if I have. No, I haven't. Fuck. How much do they have? They have quite a few planes. Like 2,500 planes. That's not good. We have no theorist available. I have no idea what this is. We could get more stability. I could swap some things around here, but I'd like the, de the defense. I like this. Static defense. Artillery attack and defense. Yeah. I like all of this. So it's just going to be stability. And I wish some of these wars would end. I mean, really, there's too many wars going on. You need to end this. Baratia versus Tikan. Uh, Baratia is almost gone. Oh yeah, they're gonna die. So there's a war going on over here. There's all the wars that the Soviets are doing. How are the Soviets doing? I like to use this as a like a barometer to see how they're doing. They have extensive conscription. And they got 2 million dudes. So they're doing fine. Because I can't really check their uh, equipment right now. I think. Mm -hmm. So there's wars going all over here. The Qing war is still going on. Oh, Georgia is done. Interesting. What about over here? There's no wars over here. Oh, wait. You guys are at war with these guys. Oh. Yeah, I think I know who's going to win that. Yeah. Is this like Paraguay or Argentina's flag? What flag looks like this? There's a modern flag that looks like this. The uh, the sort of light bluish, almost teal blue. Okay, yeah, we're going to go down here. This is going to piss off our neighbors. I don't care. So, by the way, for those interested, what you can do when you're, like, annexing a whole country is you do what I did. You press tooltip debug, which is just T debug. And then you can see more information about all this stuff. Like, you can see the province ID. It says province ID 9738. And then it says Italy. So, you can see... Like, the country tag. Os is Australia. This is the Carlist Kingdom. Oh, wait. Fuck. I'm trying to pause here. Oops. I'm going to turn off this TD book. So if you're trying to find a tag of a nation, especially in Kaiserreich, because they added a lot of nations that did not ex exist... In the base game, you can use the T debug, the tooltip debug, to uh, find that. If you are interested in cheating, like I am. One day, it's ahead of time. Is this actually going to finish in one day? It did. Holy shit. That was weird. I don't think it was supposed to do that. 1942, no. This is done. I'm going to get better destroyers. So, it says here that they're ready. And inferior enemy? Really? How are they inferior? Is it just because they are training? Why are they inferior? What about over here? I haven't told I haven't given these guys a plan at all. Mm, still preparing. I haven't told you anything to prepare. Just like this? 
No, wow, that looks ugly. Okay, like this. That should give you a preparation bonus. Uh, decryption is done. I'm going to increase my stability to good. I'm going to take a better cruiser. So destroyers and cruisers are going to be uh, level 2 or rank 2. Support equipment is done. Naval doctrine. What I want... Uh, destroyer sub detection, destroyers, destroyers, battleships, and heavy cruisers. So I'm thinking this, but no, I'm gonna go here because we were gonna finish this one and this one and this one. Yeah, so we're gonna do these three and skip the rest probably forever. Because the others are just garbage. You don't have to finish a Doctrine tree, especially when there's better stuff to take. I should probably train some more dudes, huh? What did I do? That was the wrong button. Oops. I'll join that one, and maybe you guys can train a bit. So I was gonna train... Okay, we have 42 of these. I'm going to do 12 times 4 and just have you here in Rome. And that's guy. Go and repair. No. No. Strategically redeploy and then just get in position. Okay, now train. And what about you guys? You're actually quite good. Okay. I wanted to press this button to collapse this. Hmm. I want to see here. If I do and no. Empty one, and I just do garrison. If I want to protect my shoreline, because that might actually be something I want to do, which will just garrison and engineering company. And I would train five times ten, so 50 of these dudes, just to protect stuff, coastlines and you know, other things. No, proper garrison units. Actually, I could probably add support and recon. Yeah. That should not make it that much more difficult. Expensive, than it, that is. It feels like we're going so slow. I need to check something in this game right now. Why is it running so slow? I want to say it's because of all these wars. There's so many calculations going on right now. During every single combat, there's a lot of calculations. Is that a war ending? No, that's just not a save. Mongolia is almost dead. I'm amazed that they're still in this. I have a lot of planes in reserve. It just says Bomber, 135, okay. Uh, infrastructure, let's take a look at this. Um, it's mostly fine. Yeah, it's fine. Uh, Anti-air. No, it's fine. So I'm gonna do one and two. Two and two. Two and two. Uh, you have no civilian. Civilian. 
Civilly Factory 2. Okay, so let's add. There we go. There we go. That's my OCD talking there. And we are actually almost out of time. Let's finish this one then. So like I said, let me know in the comment section what you guys think. Was it justified, the cheating I did? Like, I think this was a misclick, the kingdom that I formed here, the puppet. I, I, I did end up paying the political power anyway. So I didn't actually cheat. I could have just also like costed myself some political power, I guess. And then I just took these two provinces. That was definitely cheating. But it was for, you know, the greater good of the campaign, I want to say. Uh, and hopefully we won't have to do that in the future. Sicily under our control. I thought that was already here. Okay. Okay, whatever. Finish this. Thank you. Okay, I'm gonna stop here. So, I will see you guys in the next episode. But until then... See ya.